Hey there, pizzas. It's your old pal, Pizza Boy Anthony here. And today, we're going to be reacting to uh, the Jack Stalmer Iceberg Explained video. So, as you guys know, uh, Jack Stalmer has made over a milestone of records of music. So, let's go ahead and react to this video. It first starts off with Itch Man. The album, to his terrifying videos about crazy and scary topics, he continues to consist on his call to entertain. Today, however, we're going to look at some of the stuff you might not have heard before. From his obscure, terrifying songs to remakes of previous albums, I'm here to cover as much as I can find. This is the Jack Starber Iceberg. If you don't know what an iceberg image like this is, it's when stuff at the top of the iceberg is the most well-known topic of subject. The more you go down on the chart, the more obscure it gets. With a video like this, I couldn't do it alone. A huge thanks to Charles Ram 99 the owner of the Jack Starter Wiki, for helping me gather info for this. Also, make sure to subscribe so you can keep up to date on our latest content from this channel. With all that said, let's get started. So it starts with Buttercup. Buttercup. Buttercup refers to the first song in Jack Starter's Oh yeah, I album, recognize this. I Buttercup recognize it from Jack Thumbnail. Most popular the other songs, years. having a fan-made music video with visuals by Masaki Washa's Cake Heart, having over 175 million views. Since then, it's been used across all of the internet in fan-made music videos, remixes, and animations. Speaking of which. Animation memes. Here comes the animation An animation memes. meme refers to a piece of animation containing an artist's original character dancing or doing things to select the music. As for Jack Starber's music, it is extremely popular in this style of video, having dozens upon dozens of animations for just one song from him. These videos rank up millions of views and continue to be very popular in the Jack Starber community. Collaborative work. This section yeah, refers to songs that Jack Starber has worked on with other people. For example, Alice and Eyelash, Sign and Gabby, Sarah and Doctor, Lexi and Peppermint, and Anna and Bumblebees are out. These yep, songs are some of the most popular videos, videos on Jack's main channel and in said animation memes. Here goes the second, main channel. Main channel. Jack Starber's main channel was created on April 20th, 2010. Haha. <laughs> And the channel hosts all of his personal projects, yeah, his first ranging video from was songs, usually called, stories, uh, animatics, I have a teacher, music videos, and trailers I have a for upcoming teacher, work. Everything uh, on this channel right, is made I by Jack Starber specifically. However, the channel still has remnants of previous bands he's been in. More on that later. Adult Swim Smalls. Jack Starber's first work on Adult Swim was a musical segment on their show, Off the Air, which is the only Jack Starber project that he's worked on that's been uploaded to Jack Starber has in so his much career. Wishing Apple, it was made he for created a Wishing show, Apple Smalls, that was on channel. It was on TV. His channel. With his next project, Shop a Pop Opera, and this he is Shop his task of being a TV long segment composed of six shorts aired across one week. It gathered so much positive reviews that Adult Swim uploaded it twice. And with his latest project, Opal, it's one of the most ambitious projects for yeah, him. Yeah, so Opal came so out on just like um, a couple of months ago. Concerning some people as he didn't give any updates to it. it was very Micropops. Awesome, Micropops are a term used by Jack Starbert and his community to refer to short songs created and uploaded by Jack. The most well-known Micropops are usually the ones that are uploaded on his social media with quick music videos for them with different visuals. Famously, however, some songs are chosen by Jack to be turned into full-length songs, with new verses, lyrics, and melodies. These are known as extended songs, which are later released on small EPs under the secondary Alice and Jack Starber music too much. release I'm only react, react Jack Starber's to, Microbox. To the part where there is a now a total of 16 extended it. songs and a total of 6 extended song EPs. Something also worth noting about that's Microbox a lot of, is that there's a, a 99-track album, Microbox. The album also features many different unreleased and never before heard songs, though there arguably aren't nearly as good for their visuals. Mix and Mash Mix and Mash is a musical YouTuber that specializes in chiptune slash earthbound covers of songs. Most notably, they yeah, upload he's the obviously cover the person that who creates the remix and the, uh, and the lyrics and make it their most popular video on the channel. Also, they make other Jack Stubber covers that have been notably popular. Go check them out. They're very good. Albums Jack has been making albums ever since 2013, starting with Finite Form, 
being his first if album, I would have been a fan of Jack Sauber ever since 2013, I would have been more songs. popular. With his next album, Viator, this album Let's was start if I made a YouTube channel in 2011. Jack's first in 2011, with I would have been 40 songs 7 album, years old at the time. It's unpolished, yet has some charms to it with his various songs. His third album, Pop Food, put him on the map this by was right before High Low with 11 out. incredible songs. In his latest album, High Low, he continues to go on with the style of his music, established by Pop Food, by making 13 new songs, including samples from people he's known about with them. Up oh, here comes this last song for channel me. Hack. In May 2020, another artist channel for Jack Starver was randomly generated and started regenerating Jack's studio music. Jack later made a public post on Patreon addressing the confusion and explaining what was going on. The fake would then go on to do weird things, like changing the channel description to certain links, like Instagram profiles, and for a good while have the profile picture be the same as Jack Starver's main account. Today, all songs from the fake channel are no longer publicly available, except for Buttercup and Dog Nightmare, and it would go on to change its name to Indie Pop Music. The channel then randomly posts a video called Jack Starver Old Pictures, being a compilation of photos of and about Jack Starver. Currently, the channel uploads I wonder if Jack saw undetected HWID shooter videos. T. This refers to Jack's Key. very strange obsession, references, and hints to teeth uh, and molars. Jack is also known for commonly singing about teeth and including uh, it in his lyrics, likely using teeth as magician. metaphor, and most notably, using real teeth in his clay characters or adding good detail to teeth in his videos. He even once asked his fans to send in teeth, even revealing his address. Jack is currently never publicly why would you do why that? He Live shows. This refers to the many live shows that Jack used. Oh, I holds. guess that's his He's concert. I guess that is his concert. Uh, or at concert a house or basement. Location. Though, has performed at some bigger places like basement transmitters or that's most famously the Rex Theater. Something Jack is known for at his live shows is performing certain Guys, don't blame songs me. Blame the owner of this uh, video. Well known Not examples me. being Acelia Tears Day or Temporary. The Jack is also known for his rather energetic and upbeat energy during shows. Pizza Boy. Oh my god. Pizza Boy Anthony is a young autistic YouTuber. Yup, that is true. I Jack am Starver's on the Asperger's fans. Syndrome. Jack Starver has noticed Anthony and has shown him out in videos and even featured him in lots of work. His two biggest examples include his channel trailer being an audio clip of Anthony talking about Jack over an animated kid. The yeah, second being he's a, a final very track cool editor. Pilot, he's a very Pizza cool Ball, artist. Being named after him. The song has gone on to become one of Jack's best songs. But okay, I think I'll stop it here. Um, that's that's all of the uh, part I'm gonna sing. I wish I could see more, but. My, my head's hurting and I gotta go to rest, but that's the video, guys. That is the video that I'm going to be reacting to. Um, I'm pretty sure I watched the whole entire thing in, in person. Okay, so, well, that's going to be it for today, you guys. So, we enjoyed subscribe to Peace Boy Anthony and also one more thing. I want to give a shout-out to Exit here that, who made this video and had my cameo in the video. Which is thank you. This is gonna get a lot of views, a lot of, a lot of uh, subscribers if I upload this. Subscribe, Pizza Boy Anthony. Okay, love y'all life. Get pizzas and also shout out to Jack Stalwer.